What do you think of Rheem vs. Goodman Furnaces? Rheem is more expensive than Goodman's Furnaces, but sometimes you get what you pay for. Cheaper is better for my budget. Rheem's cheapest furnaces are the value line. It costs around as much as the best Goodman, but with slightly better reliability. It sounds like I would get what I pay for. What is the most expensive Rheem like? If you're willing to pay for it, the Prestige line is their top of the line. It has advanced controls with as many error codes as your car and a multi-speed blower that makes it ultra-efficient. I do not want to have to program my furnace. The Rheem furnace connects to the HVAC control network, if you have one. Otherwise, it is just an efficient furnace with a lot of error codes to tell you what's wrong. I still have to bring in a professional to figure out what is wrong with it. Actually, it is worse than a car mechanic because I cannot hire the equivalent of a taxi to heat my home. Rheem has a limited warranty. It covers furnaces registered within 60 days of installation. Depending on the component, it lasts 1 to 10 years. I'd be more concerned about the heat exchangers. That's the most expensive thing to fix, I think. Rheem says they warranty the heat exchangers on their most expensive furnaces for a lifetime. But on the high-end furnaces, replacing the complicated control boards is $500 or more apiece. And how does all this compare to Goodman? Rheem has more reliable equipment. Goodman's equipment is horrible, breaking down as often as they say it ought to be serviced for regular maintenance. How is Goodman service? They push an extended warranty while the company rarely honors the official one. They sometimes replace multiple parts when only one is broke, but the furnaces are so unreliable it might actually be multiple parts in need of replacement. So do not get Goodman.